okay, this is this is urgent to get out to everybody. I was trying to put a post on Facebook last night, and Facebook kept calling it spam. I got it on my wall, but they didn't want me to share it with anybody, and my friends had tried to open it. It was spam, to, according to, sp to Facebook, and it was spam because it exposes Obama, uh, the worship that people have for, for the Antichrist. And I'm going to go ahead and just, simple video, I'm going to put the link uh, as the subject line for this video. And I want you to watch it, open that link, and read it top to bottom. This blog's been going on since uh, 2007. It's still going strong. It just shows you all the different sources for the way this man is worshipped all across this country and all across the world <coughs> with lots of quotes as well. So I'm getting this out. Share with everybody you possibly can. I'll put it on all my channels. And I'll put it on Facebook so my friends who want to watch it can watch it as well. As always, if you don't know Jesus Christ as Lord and Savior, if you are backslidden either, and you and you used to be saved, but you're backslidden and you don't believe the truth in the Bible that says that once saved, always saved is a lie from hell. There is no eternal security. We're going to have a prayer here in a moment for you to have a chance to be saved. If you want the proof from the Bible I'm talking about that eternal security is a lie from hell, message me. I have 250 scripture and commentary, not my words or your words, but God's word, and it proves that you cannot step foot into heaven or be raptured unless you repent of sin in your life after you're saved. So let's pray. Jesus, I know I've sinned. I've done bad things in my life, and I'm sorry. I believe you came to earth. I believe you died on the cross for my sins. I believe you rose again on the third day, and back to heaven to be at the right-hand side of the Father. And since that time, you've made a place in heaven for all Christians forever. Please forgive me of my sins. Wash my heart white as snow. Come live in my heart. Make me a new creature in Christ. Child of the King, your precious name I ask it. Amen. Now next, get you a KJV Bible. Read it every day. It'll feed your spirit and soul the way you feed your body with food and water every day. Pray to Jesus every day. He loves you. He's your new best friend. Make sure you get water baptized. Dunk under water as soon as possible. If you're sprinkled baptized, doesn't count. Do it over again. Pray you fill with the Holy Spirit, sanctified, filled from head to toe by living for Christ, reading the Bible, and praying every day. Take that KJV Bible to church. When the preacher speaks, make sure it matches. If not, get up and walk out. Find a new church. And lastly, repent, repent, repent. Every time you sin after you're saved, repent. If you'd like me to pray for you for anything, from terminal illness to a sick pet, anything in between, contact me. I have the gift of faith, mustard seed faith. Didn't earn it or deserve it. When I prayed for it, the Lord gave it to me. If you ask me to, I'll pray for you every day. Expected a miracle in your life, and I know that God will perform that miracle if it's in His holy will. And if He does, it's all because of Him. Nothing to do with me. I've got all this stuff I just told you uh, in description of the video. I know I talk fast. I can't help it. It's how the Lord made me. You can read it there if you want to pray it as well. But please, watch this video. Open this link. Read it from top to bottom. It'll take you a while. And share it with everybody you possibly can. And just wake up and open your eyes, those who can't see, that Barack Hussein Obama is the Antichrist. I love you guys. May God bless you. Bye.